hello welcome back to my channel if you're new you're welcome and i hope you stay so due to popular request today i'm bringing you how i oven grill my super delicious chicken thighs without wasting time let's just get started so i've got my chicken thighs over here they've been cleaned every hair is off and is ready to be cooked first i will come in with some curry ginger powder some masala spice i'll come in with a little bit of seasoning black pepper some salt to taste i will come in with about five tablespoons full of my blended garlic and onion So I will go ahead and smear the seasoning on the chicken. I will come in with my ceramic knife and cut some strips on the chicken. This will help the seasoning to enter the meat easier. And I'll make sure I fill the cuts with the seasoning. Now I'll set this aside for about two hours. I'll put it in the fridge for two hours. After two hours, I'll just put it in my baking pan. As you can see, it's been lined with a net. Now it's ready to go into the oven. I have preheated the oven to about 180 degrees Celsius. I'll be baking this on the lower part of the oven for about one and a half hours. in after about 60 minutes and as you can see one part that is the upper part has been grilled well so i'll just go ahead and flip them over so that the other sides can get some heat as well afterwards i'll put them in the oven again and leave it there for about 40 more minutes so it's been after about 40 minutes and as you can see it has cooked very well this is ready and i tell you guys it smells so good. The flavor is just great. I must confess, I love my meat with onions, especially red onions. So I'll just cut some onion slices and sprinkle them onto the meat. This will add some extra flavor. Yes, you are invited. You definitely need to give this a try. It tastes and smells so delicious. So I hope I did help you and I hope you are going to give this a try. If you do, let me know how it comes out for you. If you've not subscribed, please don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Don't forget to share this with family and friends and don't forget to leave me that big fat thumbs up. Until next time, I am going to see you again with another nice and interesting one. Bye bye.